Hello! Karage deep fried chicken is a very popular dish in all over the world. Today I'm gonna marinate with very new, unique, and popular seasoning, shio koji. Koji is an edible fungus. Most of the Japanese seasonings are made from this fungus fermentation, such as shoyu, miso, uh, rice vinegar, mirin, sake, yeah, almost everything. <laughs> it contains a rich enzyme, so make protein result to be uh, digestible and release a large amount of amino acid, which is the source of umami. Yeah, I can't stop talking when I think about koji. <laughs> yeah, today I'm gonna show you how it's like and how to make homemade shio koji. So let's get started. Koji is cooked rice berry or beans that have been inoculated with the fermentation culture and rice koji is the most popular in Japan. This is the one made in the US on your left you can get it in an American supermarket. Especially it's easy to get in an organic supermarket. In my case I've been using this domestic one because it's easily available and inexpensive. On your right, it's a popular shiokoji product that is ready to use. There is an instruction on the back, and it says shiokoji can be simply poured onto meat, fish, or vegetable as a marinade or added as a sauce or dressing. Shio means salt. Shiokoji is salt and koji's compound noun. So I'm gonna make shiokoji using salt and koji and water too. Pour the koji and the salt into a large bowl and wrap them for a while so that koji mold can be easily activated by hand. This process will sort of wake up koji from the sleep. If you use Japanese soft koji, it's better to rub before combined with salt. Add the same amount of water as a koji and lightly cover with a plastic wrap. Add more water to barely cover the surface. Make sure the shiokoji are always submerged in water. Mix koji with a spoon once a day for a week. That's it! This is the third day of it. Looks getting softened and smells slightly mild. This is the seventh day of it. See, it looks very different. When you smell it has banana legs with aroma and it becomes soft and thick, it's ready to use. Please note that the process of fermentation depends on the temperature. If you live in cool area, it takes around 10 days to be well fermented.
So let's double fry. At first, fry at a lower temperature to cook chicken gradually. Let them sit for 5 minutes to cook with the remaining heat. On the second round, fry at high heat to create crispy outside. So how did you like it? Koji is a magical seasoning. You can replace with chicken breast instead of a chicken thigh. It should be amazingly tender and juicy karage. Koji can be used as a substitute for salt or soy sauce. My recommendations are koji marinated tomato and boiled egg. Please try and let me know what you think. So thank you guys for watching and see you next time. Bye!